Hi, good day to all the panels. My name is Sao Zing. Today, I would like to discuss with you all about my final year project too. My title is Identifying Calendaring Machine Breakdown by FMEA, a case study of a paper manufacturing industry. I'm supervised by Professor Matya in senior Dr. Muhammad Min Minhan. This is my presentation outline for today. It consists of five main chapters. First of all, I would like to ask you all one question. Do you all even know about what is paper? Paper is normally that we use for record or write something. Basically, it is made up of bark from the woods and some combination of the chemical substance. According to Carrick 2017, he claimed that paper is normally used because it is cheaper and more convenient compared to bamboo, silk, and also wood. What is calendaring process? Calendaring process is one of the paper manufacturing process that used to improve or increase the smoothness or glossy level of the paper. Basically, this process is normally carried out by passing the single continuous sheet through several pairs of heated roller. What is FMEA? According to Robin Ken 2016, he claimed that FMEA is one of the strategies that used to determine the potential problems or impact for the process or the product. There are two main purposes of applying FMEA. First, it's used to anticipate the problem in the early stage for a second, it tends to reduce the excessive costs required, especially in terms of machine maintenance. There are seven problems that one has found in the paper manufacturing industry, especially in failure of calendaring machine. First, calendar roller problem. For the calendar roller problem, the surface of the calendar roller is normally worn out that caused the failure of calendaring machine. Second, narrow calendar nib width. The narrow calendar nib width will affect the pressure exerted on the paper sheet, especially during the calendaring machine. Third, machine temperature. Inconsistent machine temperature during the operation will also affect the internal condition of the calendaring machine. Fourth, coating material. Inconsistent coating material will also affect the paper coating process. Fifth, moisture level of the paper. For moisture level of the paper indicates that too much of water content in the paper that caused the paper thickness has increased. Unorganized maintenance plans. Unorganized maintenance plans is normally found that in terms of overrunning of the machine. Lastly, it's about the poor quality of the paper. For poor quality of paper, the condition is normally found, especially in terms of paper stuck in between the calendar roller. There are three main objectives of this study. First, to determine and identify the common issue and problem that caused the calendaring machine to break down. Second, to apply the PFMEA in order to reduce the calendaring machine from breakdown. Third, to develop the preventive maintenance plan for the in-service machinery, which is the calendaring machine for controlling the paper quality. There are four scopes of this study. First, Focus in typical issues that cause the calendaring machine to break down. Second, to study the various calendaring process that will be applied in the paper manufacturing processes. Third, the failure of each type of calendaring process will be analyzed in order to find out the possible solution to solve the possible failure. Fourth, to study the effectiveness of PFMEA in order to eliminate the risk of the failure, especially in terms of process or the machine. There are also three significance of this study. First, to understand the possible failures of calendaring process during the paper manufacturing processes. Second, to enhance the knowledge, especially in terms of determining the paper quality and also several paper quality testing processes have been learned throughout this research study. Third, it is also the practicing of the FMEA approach in order to reduce the extra cost, especially in terms of machine maintenance costs. Future Review Part 1. Didi Chelsea and Devin Guring 2016 and also Hidehiko Yamazaki 2015 have claimed that the calendaring process is one of the paper finishing process that must be, must be undergone by the paper in order to increase the smoothness and also the glossy level of the paper. Failure of calendaring machine is normally found in terms of calendar roller. As the picture shows, the calendar roller will normally found in failure, especially when the fitting occurs and also the thickness variation at the roller ends. Literature Review Part 2. FMEA is one of the review from the risk assessment, failure mode identification, and also industrial standard application. After that, do you all even know what is about the severity? For the severity, it indicates that it is the magnitude of the end effect of the system failure. When there is the more severity of the consequence, the value of the severity also becomes the higher. Occurrence. Occurrence is one of the frequency of the root cause that likely to occur in a qualitative way. In this situation, it is not in the form of period of time, but it is classified as a remote or occasionally. For the detection, it is the likelihood of detecting the root cause before the failure has occurred. Chapter 3, Methodology. Final year project will be consist of two parts, which are FYP1 and also FYP2. During FYP1, there are three main activities will be undergo, which are research study, data collection, and also identify the available problems. And for FYP2, there are six 
activities will be undergo in FYP2. First, prepare the template of the FMEA. Second, perform analysis through FDA, parallel chart, Ishikawa diagram, and also CID metrics. Third, develop ranking skill. Fourth, develop PFMEA. Five, analyze PFMEA. And number six, develop maintenance plan. Chapter four, result and discussion. First of all, I would like to discuss with you all about the fourth three analysis, or also known as FDA. So FDA, students have found that five of the different problems has been found in the paper manufacturing industry, especially in terms of the failure of calendaring machine. In this situation, first one is calendar roller worn out with the total highest total frequency is 75 rows per month. And for the second is paper web stuck in between the calendar roller with the total frequency 28 rows per month. Narrow calendar need width with 17 rows per month. And Fourth one is about the coating material of the paperwork with the 32 rows per month. And for the last one is about the unorganized maintenance plan with the total defect by frequency is 11 rows per month. Through FDA, it enables the student to identify the failure of the calendaring machine through different perspective. After that, it also enables the student to have a clear insight in order to identify which condition need to be prioritized and also it is the most significant issue in the paper calendaring industry in order to solve their difficulties. The second analysis tool that will apply in this research study is Pareto chart. Based on the table, there are two different colors will be used, especially used for indicate the winter field and also tribal many. In this situation, the winter field condition of the problems of the calendaring machine will be indicated in the dark blue color, whereas for the tribal many will be indicated in terms of light blue color. In this situation, the 8029 is plotted on the Pareto chart as shown at the right hand side. The 8029 will be used to classify the waste generated by the calendaring machine. All these 10 perspectives are noted as winter field, and it is also one of the major contributors of the waste generation, especially during the calendaring machine failure. For the tribal many, it is also known as the final contributor, and this only will have the relatively small effects in terms of waste generation when the calendaring machine is break down. The analysis tool will be applied in this research study is fishbone diagram, or also known as the Ishikawa diagram, as shown at the right hand side. In this situation, there are six different categories will be involved in order to identify what are the possible failure from six different perspectives that cause the failure of the calendaring machine. The fourth analysis tool that will be used is the cost effect metric, or also known as the C and E matrix, as shown at the below table at the right hand side. In this situation, the C and E matrix is known as the most significant tools that used to identify the failure of the calendaring machine is caused by the calendar roller. According to Neil Kahn and AK Ray 2020, they claim that the failure of the calendar roller has greatly affected the surface property of the papers. After that, the paper web is considered as the second common input that caused the failure of the calendaring machine. During this situation, the paper known as the inputs which pass through the series of the calendar roller for the smooth turning and also improve the glossy level of the papers. Next is about the failure mode and effect analysis or also known as FMEA. Before kickstart FMEA, student is required to develop the PFMEA template and the second step is about developing the ranking skill. In this situation, there are three main ranking skills will be involved which are severity, occurrence and also detection. After that is about the PFMEA. Basically, PFMEA is the analysis of the common issue for the failure of the calendaring machine, especially in the paper manufacturing industry. After completing PFMEA, students will identify what are the possible failure of the calendaring machine through different perspectives. The most significant most which introduced to the failure of calendaring machine is in the perspective of paper stuck in between the calendar roller. Besides, the high productivity during high customer de demand has also caused the overrunning of the machine during the operation. Sometimes, this issue has led to the shortened lifespan of the running parts in the calendaring machine. This machine will overrunning is because of the high demand of the customer. This is the preventive maintenance plan that have been developed. Basically, the problem that have found is in terms of five different categories, which are calendar roller problems, failure of machine controller, failure of port wheel drum, failure of coating material, and also poor quality of the paper. In this situation, the suggestion preventive maintenance plan that have suggest are standard operating procedure, or also known as SOP, calibration of equipment, or instrument, annual workers training, staff evaluation, engineering methods such as work study, method study, and also the continuous improvement. 
chapter 5, conclusion and recommendation. The possible failure of calendaring machine have found in terms of six different perspectives that was notified in the fishbone diagram or also known as Ishikawa diagram. It can notify that most significant failures of calendaring machine is in terms of machine and material itself. By having this control method that has been suggested, the risk of the failure of the calendar machine can be mitigated. There are two recommendations would be used in order to improve the research study. Design of experiment, which known as DOE, is also one of the approach can be used to conduct to determine whether which parameter will be involved. For example, in this situation, the suitable parameters in terms of machining speed, temperature controller, optimum need width for the calendar roller are the key parameters that need to be concerned in order to make sure that the failure of the calendaring machine tends to be mitigated. Lastly, this is about the reference. Thank you for watching.